two different versions of Rayman 2. Rayman 2 is actually quite the fun Gravity game. suit, yes! Yes! Uh -huh. Thank God. Where is that blue circle thing? This run... Perfect. Has a lot easier. Oh well, I thought you were going to say perfect. No, not yet. What? Not a yet to get the chance. plasma beam? What? Yet to get the plasma beam? Yeah. Another good example. Damn too. it. I've yet to get the spring ball. Then my... My playthrough should be complete. But you should probably go and get yourself, uh... Rayman 2. Okay. I got it on a 3DS as my first one. Damn it, I'm not gonna get this time. I got... No blue eco the entire time. I hit so many things and I barely lost. Wow, maybe it's all of the racing games I've been playing lately, but uh, this stuff seems to be hard. Oh shit, I just screwed it up. <laughs> I almost made it too. It would have been kick ass. So are you looking forward to the Super Metroid commentary if we ever get to it? Uh, yeah, that's that's definitely gonna be something I can uh, get Nathan on board. Hello, space jump. Yep, this playthrough's gotten better. Yep, screwed up and. Less than two seconds lost. Okay, I'll try and go f down. I just missed a blue go. Hey, should I go straight to Ridley again? Ah, uh, you can. Trying to race here. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to jump on that. Well, I don't think I'm shaped up enough to do Ridley. New record. Nice. When I see new record on the screen, all I can think of is Mario Party. Does that ever happen to you? I love the way that they say new record in that game. Yep. It's really, really satisfying. I still need to get back on to Mario Party 3. Best one so far. Do you know what we need to do? Make a drinking game out of it. Um, I, I, I don't like drinking. I don't like alcohol. I don't like people that drink alcohol. Just a little, uh, just a little oddity about me. Drinking okay. games, not likely to so happen. So, what do you like? Boobs. How about that? Oh, okay. It's I a think bet Japan on porn got magazines. For that. How about that? We're going to bet our non-existent porn magazines. By non-existent, I mean I use internet. You probably have magazines, you barbarian. Get on the internet. <laughs> That's what it's made for. Get on with the times. Another seventh scout fly. I'm gonna be full by the time I get all these scout flies. Hello, Krakamar. You gonna kill him again? Yeah, but not in one hit this time. I'm gonna have a plasma beam. And so that I have 66 uh, super missiles. 
How many? One more? Fuck. You know how difficult it is to find one precursor orb? I'm still haunted by that time I tried recording this game the first time and I could not for the life of me find that one precursor orb and the spider caves. Eat radiation cracker mire. It should not burn your face off alive. Power bomb. That's morbid. Uh, that is really morbid. What? Bitch, I'll burn your face off alive. <laughs> well, that's what happens in the boss fight. Regardless. I don't know where this last precursor orb is. And I don't know where the blue ring is. I would like the blue ring, to be honest. And that precursor orb, I have no idea where it is. Probably not in the uh, front area, it has to be in the back. Okay, oh, found the blue ring. And I fell off. What the hell? Now, if this was Burnout Revenge, oh, the fail would be so high because I'm, a, I'm right at rank 10, dude. I've never actually gotten to rank 10 before. Rank 10? Uh, Explain to me. Hurry, the next it basically, all the events... Oh, got the last precursor orb. Um, every single one of the... Um, the, the, the game gives you um, stars based upon how well you do in events. Once you actually get enough stars, you'll unlock another rank, and another rank will give you more events. And crap... Oh, I still got it. Um, there's only ten ranks in the entire game, and I finished everything up to rank nine. One more event left, and that's the... Grand Prix. I got four more Raws probably left for that game. And I can't wait to be done. Yeah. I'm not going to say it's the hardest game in the series. But it's up there. Now I think about it. You have Burnout Paradise Ultimate Box, but you haven't played it yet. Yes, what about it? Uh, maybe if it's cheap. You can go and uh, get me it, and then we can go play on uh, Steam. I got, I got, think I got it for a bundle, so... Yeah. yeah. I don't have that game anymore. I, I sold it. Was it any good? No, it's good. It's just once you get to the A license, it suddenly kind of feels like you crash every two seconds, and I'm not shitting you. It's a pretty good game to have with friends, I I'll say, but, uh... Single-player experience, uh, not my favorite one. Through the door. Okay, got everything. Now to leave. Yep, I think I'm gonna head for Norfair. I mean, Ridley, excuse me. Forty-two percent! So happy with myself. I could cry. You're so happy with myself. Thank you, for you want me to cry. Awfully good of you. Here's a power cell to help you out. Just to make you feel better about yourself. Yeah. Now what should That's I, exactly what should I, I go to, to Boggy Swamp or should I go to Lost Precursor City? Lost Precursor City. Oh, 
damn it. Okay, fine, I want to get two videos done, this one and the next one. Hopefully, you'll be uh, sort of done by uh, that time. But, um... God damn it. The Lost Precursor City is a great level, but... It kind of drags on, especially if you want to get everything. That sliding little section goes on for too long, and you you miss anything, you have to go and redo it. I hate that part. Oh yeah, I remember that. That's a pain. But it's quite the level. Quite like the level. It is. Oh, that's I think it was right. one of my favorite levels. And it's probably the difficult level of the second area. True. Most difficult of the second area. Yeah, d hell yeah. Great moves, kid. I knew that time record would fall. Now here's your power cell. They're giving me precursor orbs and power cells like they're candy. Granted, I'm also giving them precursor orbs like it's candy. But, um... I'm getting way too much too fast and the big bad lurker shark's gonna be coming for me if I step in that water. Actually, now I think about it, what the hell is that? Is it like a wind chime or something? Uh, it's some kind of cloth fabric thing? What are you talking about now? I'm just looking at this thing. For, from what I know, it, it's some little decoration. You can see it on the playback when I upload this. But, um, all I know, whoever the fuck put this over here had to have been eaten by the lurker shark. It's right in the middle of the water, and it's kind of far <laughs> from the, uh, the platform. That's a cool touch, at the mid. That seems like it would be a cool touch. Lost Precursor City. Oh god, I hate you. Into Ridley. The enemies in this place kind of are pretty harm, very very harmful actually. There's a lot of stage hazards in this one too. A lot of gimmicks too. Ugh. All these platforms. Hate these platforms. Don't we all hate platforms? Isn't that the true enemy in platforming games? Yes. The platforms. For a second, a I thought it was the, the developers. Camera. But no, it's the platforms. All this time, I thought it was the developers that were the true enemy. And I died. <laughs> At least uh, I got one of those Daxter lines. You know how you die in a certain way? Oh yeah! It kind of falls back and then there's that line. They, they actually bring that back in Jack 3 if you die the same way. But um, unlike the first game, it's kind of difficult to actually get yourself to die in that way. I'll save that for later. Um, okay. You know what game I haven't played in a while? Super Metroid? Tropical 4. Have you played Tropical 4? No. Any good? Hell yeah. You got to be a little dictator. Haven't you always wanted to be a little Banana Republic dictator? Oh, found it. Yay! Precursor orbs. Rolling in the money. Rolling in the money. Alright, let's na, see what na, we na, get na, here. Na, na. I got money. 
Yay, me. Fuck me. I hate you, platform. It was trying ah, to kill me. Grappling beam. Well, that is a bummer. You killed me before, Luckers. Lurker bros. Die. Oh, you got me again. Lurker brothers. Um, how am I going to get up? Come here, platform. I'll bribe you. Might as well bribe the developer. Ah oh, no, I bought the game. <laughs> um, ah. Maybe I'll bribe them to go and make another Jack and Daxter game. I know a lot of people on that. Everybody wants that. Actually, how many, uh, you probably haven't played a lot of, uh, Naughty Dog's, uh, games, but, uh... I've played all the Crash series, but that's it. And then Jack and Daxter. No Uncharted yet, so... All Since I know I is, I, I hear The Last of Us is, uh, just amazing, but... That is to be expected by the great Naughty Dog. They've never tripped up once. Completely. Completely. Uh, My no, 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 no. Um, have you played those Genesis games? They have Genesis games? Yes! They did that's stuff. Why they, that's why I never know of them, because they're that bad. No. Nobody gives oh. a shit. Uh, I still need to go and play them. They, they sound like generic RPGs, to be honest, but... Just from the title. But you can never judge a game by its title. And I die once again to Lurker. I'm like, uh, Stretcher! Yuck. No, Daxter, I would not want a breath mint. If you're wondering what I'm doing, I'm, I'm restocking on super missiles. Actually, I'm fight. thinking at the moment, what PSP games should I actually go buy my next, uh, little PSP game buying spree? What do you have? Well, I have 13 games in the PSP. I'm gonna go and think about which ones I actually have. Well, I got Persona 3. Ratchet and Clank, Size Matters, Secret Agent Clank, Daxter, Jack and Daxter, Lost Frontier. Ah, damn it, got, got into the electric water. And again into the electric water! Son of a bitch. And fuck me once more into the electric water. That was failure. That place always remind me of the sewer levels in Crash Bandicoot. Yeah. It actually does. And also the laboratory levels with the, uh, glowing hot pipes, but... Yeah, definitely. But, um, I also have Lord of the Rings Tactics, uh, Final Fantasy Tactics, War of the Lions, get the original game. Um, Naruto Ultimate Ninja Heroes, Actually, a really good fighting game. I'm uh, quite addicted to it. I'm trying to think of any other ones. Burnout Legends, Battlefront 2. I'm trying to think if I have any other ones. Pat Upon 2. That's about it. What should I get? I 
paddle pond too, just based on the title. No, I I have that. Oh, excuse me. It is it's quite the interesting game. It's a rhythm based game. At the same time, it's also kind of RPG like. At the same time, also strategy like. It's quite the interesting game. I, I gotta miss a uh, really nice PSP game if you ever get yourself a PSP. And there is three games in the series. So there's always going to be plenty of missions if you go and buy them all. Damn it. Fallen in the water yet again. This time it wasn't electrified. But, um, yeah, definitely, if you can get Pat upon too, I, I would go for it. Platforms, you've returned to me. This is why I love you guys. I love you dearly. Oh, this this room. Could you stop shooting at me? I believe you should start playing more RPGs. First Why do one I you should play. RPGs when I have Super Metroid. Uh, you should go play Super Mario RPG. Eh. No, don't, no, don't say that. If you're gonna do that, go say it to the, um, Mario and Luigi series. I cannot get myself to play that game. Damn it, and I fell, yet again! I mean, I mean, I played a little bit of that game, but not, didn't really get into it. I, I, I cannot get myself into the, the original Super uh, Mario and Luigi RPG game. Actually, same thing with Paper Mario. Except a thousand year door. Holy shit, is that a good game. If you ever felt like playing a Mario RPG, go play a thousand year door. A thousand year door is probably the best Paper Mario game, easily. And best Mario RPG. Except if you like nostalgia, and then that would be Super Mario RPG. Holy shit, that game. Great music, great gameplay, really quite humorous uh, interactions between everybody. And it's actually, it's easily the best Mario in any Mario game. He actually has personality. Oh, shoot. You gotta be kidding me. And plus, I like his charades. <laughs> Have you ever played charades? Yes. If you could play charades with Mario, would you? Yes. I would too. He seems to be damn good at it. He's on my team. Though he's still a mute, so he's probably bad at guessing what you're doing. That's a plus! <laughs> Your Mario impression's off the wall. What? I wasn't... That was me. I'm not... I'm bad at impressions. Why would I do an impression of Mario when I could probably do a worse one of Luigi? Do impressions? What do you take me for? Not Somebody good. with actual talent? <laughs> yes. Well, not with my voice. I know for a fact I can. I had a talent 
for pretty much everything. Or eh, enough to get myself going and do whatever I wanted to, except anything that had to do with my voice. No way in hell did I have a future and singing and any kind of speech preparation anything of that sort which is actually kind of sad because I do this this commentary gig and I believe I fail at it I just fail slightly less than you. What? At this commentary gig. I, I don't know, I'm, I think I'm pretty successful, you. mind you. Um, if we go by numbers, then uh, you have me on the views, but then again, you also played Blue's Clues on uh, that other guy's channel. Yeah. I, uh, consider you to be the bane of my existence by, um, validating that, uh, Blue's Clues was a thing. A huge thing in my childhood, so, um, thanks for that. <laughs> really? Oh, yeah. Um. You like Blue's Clues? Yeah, one time I did. I was, uh, damn good at it, too. I was damn good at finding those clues. And I could Don't sing say. along, too. But I never did, because uh, we already established that I suck. Oh my gosh! I never do that. What? These guys are immune to my missiles. It doesn't even cause them to flinch. Yeah, well, I'm stopping it here. And I'm gonna be doing All another right. video. Only one 